it's pain you can't get away from. Even in your happiest moments, you just, it eats you up. Anthony Lafrenier suffered a traumatic brain injury and other injuries when a car he was riding in was hit by a wave bus in May. He'd been fighting to recover in Atlanta and Jacksonville. He even got the opportunity to spend Thanksgiving with his family. That was a great day. And, and then to be followed so quickly by this tragedy, you know, and just not knowing. Recently, he was finally given the okay to go home. From the instant he got home, he was a completely different kid. I mean, he was he was coming back. But on December 10th, he suddenly lost consciousness. And we're standing there talking to him when he just collapsed. Um, we immediately did CPR, and, you know, had the ambulance out, but um, they were just never able to bring him back. His body was flown from Jacksonville back to Mobile Tuesday night where he was greeted by a small crowd of friends, family, and Mobile County Sheriff's deputies. It was still a tough thing. You know, you, know, you just, you never want to see your kid come home in a shipping container. This 16-year-old was a volunteer for the Team Sheriff Explorer program and already devoted his life to service. The best way to honor my son is to go out and do the same thing. Never leave a person hungry, never leave a person cold, you know. Do what you can for your community. In Mobile, Nicolette Schleisman, WKRG News 5.